Howdy, this is Pell Ryder, and welcome back to a very, very dark episode of Fallout New Vegas. Sorry about the problem here. Oh, dang it. I was trying to turn on at least my Pip Boy light, but that didn't do any good at all. So I need to go up here at nighttime to talk to Boone. He's the nighttime sniper. You know, last episode we met Manny. He's the daytime sniper. And Boone is up here at night. Let me turn on my light so we can see him. Um, this is my favorite companion to use because he has a sniper perk that's really cool. So I want to initiate his... Uh, most of the companions in this game, you have to do a certain perk to actually get them to fall or a certain quest to actually get them to follow you first and after you after they follow you you do a companion quest that goes little by little um you have to get points to add it up and and then at each, different stages of their quest they'll give you more information and talk to you and then by the end of their quest then they give you a better perk than than initially started you know so um yeah i want to try to at least get him with us so we can be a foursome here we can be the fab four and so that's the first perk that i'm gonna or the first quest that i'm gonna do in novak is him and then i'll do the rest of them which there's at least three other four other ones um to choose from all right so let's start talking to him God damn it. Don't sneak up on me like that. What do you want? Sneak up on you? You're not a very good freaking uh, sniper, dude. I came through the freaking door. And this is a really small area and you couldn't hear me? What's up with that? Expecting visitors? Just looking around. Heard there was a sniper nest up here. Okay. Expecting visitors? Yeah, I guess maybe I am. But not like you. Huh. Maybe it should have been you I was expecting all along. Why are you here? If you're looking for someone in particular, I could tip you off if I see them. Yeah, I got the speech, so this might work. Yeah, well, you see anybody wearing Legion Crimson or a lot of sports equipment, you just let me know. You still haven't answered my question. Yeah. I just wanted to check out the view. I'm meeting new people. I think you better leave. Just making friendly conversation. Do you threaten everyone around here like this? I don't see how that affects me. I, I don't have friends here. Well, I'm not from here. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good no. answer. No, you're not, are you? Maybe you shouldn't go. Not just yet. Why is that? So now you want something from me. Are you going to try to kill me? Why is that? I need someone I can trust. You're a stranger. That's a start. That's a start. <laughs> what do you want me to do? You only trust strangers? I said it was a start. This town, nobody looks me straight in the eye anymore. I want you to find something out for me. I don't know if there's anything to find, but I need someone to try. My wife was taken from our home by Legion slavers one night while I was on watch. They knew when to come, what route to take, and they only took Carla. Someone set it up. I don't know who. You're trying to track down your wife? My wife's dead. I want the son of a bitch who sold her. What do I do if I find this person? How do you know your wife's dead? Let me try that one first. I know, all right. That's all you need to know. Okay. Uh, what do you do if you find this person? Bring him out in front of the nest here while I'm on duty. I work nights. I'll give you my NCR beret to put on. It'll be our signal, so I know you're standing with him. And I'll take care of the rest. I need to do this myself. 
I'll see what I can do to help you out. Yep. Good. I'll make it worth your while. Oh god, you look funny with that. And one more thing. We shouldn't speak again. Not until it's over. No one in town knows that I know what happened to my wife. Best they never know. Or the Legion will be after me next. Goodbye. Yeah. Okay. So this is a freaking kind of a sad quest, but it's, it's kind of freaking crazy too. So let me go in here and look at the data for the quest. Okay, Nighttime Sniper, that's Manny's quest. Um, yeah, that's the ranch quest. Okay. One for my baby. Okay, first of all, what he said, send someone in front of the Dinky the Dinosaur, put on the beret to signal that Boone, to Boone that this is the culprit. Okay. You can actually go get anybody in town, any of the name characters at least. I don't know, maybe one of the other ones, but I don't. I doubt it. I think it's just any of the named characters in town to follow you out to in front of the dinosaur, and he will kill them instantly when you put the beret on. But optionally, you can ask around Novak and actually find out who is the is the right person. Um, I don't know if th this will give you bad karma if you pick the wrong person. Probably will give you bad karma and probably give you a bad reputation with this town if you pick the re bad, wrong person. I never tried doing it that way. I've always asked around. So that's the best bet now is just to go around and ask, talk to people. And it's not... Let me, before I even go outside, let me make it freaking light out because it's way dark. Okay, so that'd be 245, 345, 4, 5, 645, should be light. Yay. How you doing? Hey, dude, what's up? Oh, I could talk to him. I forgot. Hey. Welcome back. Can I get you anything? Um... Can I ask you about Boone's wife? Can't say we spoke much. Boone did most of the buying for him. She was in the store once, but she didn't stay long. Had a look on her face like she'd smelled something sour. But far as I can remember, the gift shop smelled fine. Well, fine as it always does. See right there. Come with me. There's something I that you should see in front of the diner. I can do that to I think almost anybody with a name that you could talk to in the game or in this town will give you that option. Okay, so that's all the information he gives you about her, which kind of sucks. But you Come can get other now. info from other people and back go back and forth a few times, I think. Um, let me go talk to the nosy buddy here. Where's he at? I guess I could have talked to what's her name. I don't really want to go in. I think it's too early. He's bo booby traps this freaking house, so it's kind of screwed up to go in here. Uh, not with this many people. I will get blowed up. I I need to test Willow and see if I can get her to stay now. Um, let me go talk to the other people. Maybe freaking no bark will come out by then. It's only the dock and then the other couple down there, and then there's the lady in the motel. What can I do for you? Oh, you can't even talk to her about it, huh? Bye. I thought you could. Let me. Can you even talk to these other guys? She hasn't paid me anything yet. Should I be worried? Between you and me, I don't think she's studied at an accredited institution. <laughs> she's not a real doctor. And she's not paying her freaking workers. Okay. Now you can get into that house. 
Let's see what's in there. Oh, that's Jeannie's, Jeannie May, lady at the diner, or at the motel. Look who's, what brings you here? Can you tell me about Boone's wife? Wait, can you tell me about the attacks on the ranch first? Well, that's the strangest thing. Last time it happened, I could swear I heard someone cry out for help. Sounded like a big fella. But when we finally got up the gumption to go look outside, all we found was our cattle. And I know what they sound like when they get upset. I can't imagine what went on. Dusty can probably tell you more about it. All right. Can you tell me about Boone's wife? Boone. That's that sniper fella. Works in the dinosaur, right? I only met them but once or twice. They seem real happy together. I really ought to get to know them better. They're probably nice folk. She don't act like she even knows that she's missing. Nice of you to visit. Where's the hubby? Howdy. I can hear you. Oh, there he is. Find anything? Not yet. Well, don't worry yourself too much over it. You can tell me about Boone's wife. Well, to be honest with you, I don't really know them two as well as I might. I remember she had an edge about her. Like she'd rather be someplace else. This kind of life ain't for everyone. That's for darn sure. Talked about her in so past tense. She had an edge to her. Um, yeah. People don't didn't tend to like her around here a whole lot. She was kind of snobby. Oh, now it's daytime. Um, Manny will be up there. I forgot I could talk to him, too. Let me go talk to Manny first, and then maybe this dude will be out by then. Now, oh, let's just go talk to this lady. I forgot. Hey there. Oh, she's got some dino souvenirs, too. There's dino souvenirs, and then there's the rocket souvenirs. I hope you're finding everything to your liking. What's wrong with Boone? Nothing that wouldn't be wrong with any man who loses a wife, I suppose. Poor dear. I know he thinks she was kidnapped, but I'm not so sure she didn't just run off on her own. You could tell she was thinking about it ever since they arrived. What can you tell me about her? How should I put it? I guess you could say she was kind of like a cactus flower. Real pretty to look at, but there was just no getting close to her. She never did take to living here. She liked the big lights and fast living of New Vegas. I got the feeling she was trying to get Boone to leave with her, but I guess she got tired of waiting. And that's all she says? Watch out for strangers. So, yeah. Boone's wife didn't like it here because she's used to Vegas. How you doing? You go talk to your other sniper again. Oh, that's Boone. Oh, you know what? I think they switch um, places at 9 o'clock p.m. and a.m. 12-hour shifts. So Manny should be in his room still. It's one of these. There it is. And this one's Boone. No. See, that's a... Marked as red. There's Boone's room. Boone's is marked as red, but Manny's is marked in white. So Boone's is actually... mess up your karma if you go in you have any luck with the ghouls I'm counting on you um, who would want to hurt Boone's wife did you have any 
anything to do with Boone's wife's disappearance. Let's try this one first. Man, everybody. That girl didn't have one friend in this whole town. She didn't want any. She wanted to sit in a room all day and make herself miserable, and she went out of her way to be rude. She upset a lot of people. You wouldn't have liked her either. Okay. Did you have anything to do with the disappearance? Believe me, when I heard the news, my first thought was, I owe somebody big. I figured Boone would come around after a while. But he hasn't. And I'm starting to think that if he doesn't find her, things will never go back to the way they were. So this guy's got the biggest motive to get rid of her. Yeah, see ya. There's only one person that I haven't talked to yet. Been to the top of the dino yet? Is the old man. Crazy dude. I can't remember what's upstairs here. Oh, whoa, what's this? Daisy. Forgot about her. Fine weather for flying. It's times like these that make me miss it all. You a pilot? Vertebrate pilot. 71 missions and only lost one chopper. Rotor malfunction over Klamath. Hard landing, but I walked away. What did what do you do in Novak? I help folks strip down the more complicated bits of salvage they bring in. Engines mostly. The bits and pieces we take out are usually worth more than the whole thing put together. Did you fly for the NCR? Four? No, not exactly. It was a long time ago. Things are a lot different these days, and those days are way behind me. She didn't really answer that. Watch your six out there. I can't ask her about Boone's wife either. Okay, this one you can go into. But things are stealing. There's a cap. Uh, it's a star bottle cap, too. Yeah, I know. I lost karma. I tend to do that. Nothing good. That was it. I can get into a lot of these. Oh, who's this? Oh, please don't kill me. I swear I'll have... Wait. You, oh, you don't work guy. for Mr. Bishop, do you? Lie. Yes, I do. It's time for you to suffer. Uh, no, I don't. What makes you think that? Sorry, it's just you look like his type, you know. You got that hard-ass wasteland explorer thing going on. Aren't you that singer from New Reno? I think I saw you play the club there. I thought I lost my memory. Oh, so you have heard of me. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I was the big draw at the Shark Club. People used to pay hundreds of caps to see me. Why did you come all the way out here from Reno? You don't know Mr. Bishop. He's not like other bosses up there. He knows the wasteland like the back of his hand, and he likes to wander it. I knew if I didn't get way the hell away from New Reno, he'd run me down like a dog. Um, why did this Mr. Bishop... Why would this Mr. Bishop be after you? Oh, well, that's all just a big misunderstanding, see? Mr. Bishop, well, he owed me a lot of money, and, uh, you know, he's a busy guy, so I sort of figured I'd just take it off his hands. Yeah, he stole it from the casino. You robbed a casino, boss. Robbed is such an ugly word. It's more like I took care of a payroll problem for him. Also, I might have uh, sort of plowed his daughter a little <laughs> A little? How do you plow somebody a little? Uh, well, my hat's off to you. That takes some balls. Yeah, it does. Let's try the balls one. Thanks. But if Bishop finds me and I don't have his money, my balls are going to be on his trophy wall. Yeah. Uh, 
That's a tough break. Good luck with that. I'll let you know if I find any work for a singer. You do that? Great. I really appreciate that. That's actually a quest later in the game. Uh, yeah, yeah. See you later. And there's two or three options of singers. Meet different people along the way like that. Forgot all about him, though. There's another one that's not too far from here. He's sitting here trying to fix a motorcycle in his room. Looks like. What do you got there? Oh, yeah. I'll take that, too. Conductor. Uh, yeah, I might as well. 